morning, Haynes Bridge. Welcome to your HBTV broadcast. I'm Kane. And I'm Elizabeth. Today is Tuesday, October 3rd, 2023. If you would like, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, I allegiance, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please join us now for a moment of silence. The Fulton County Technology Fair is coming up soon. To tell you all about it and how you can participate, here's Dr. Sutton. Hey everybody, this is Dr. Sutton. I wanted to do an announcement about the Fulton County Technology Fair that happens annually every year. The who this is for are, your, are our sixth, seventh, and eighth grade students here at Haynes Bridge. Technology Fair projects are the what. We want to see if you can create us some wonderful projects this year. The when will be December the 9th, 2023, will be the actual fair that will happen at the where Riverwood High School. And why would you do this? To enrich your education and possibly come home with a win. So if you're wondering how to get started, come by my room to get an information sheet, join my technology fair teams, or I will place you in there once you say you're interested, create your topic, check the category your project will fit into, and that's it. Okay, so that's almost it. So between October the 3rd and October the 15th, you need to submit your name to Dr. Sutton with your title and category. On October the 16th, I will sign up students for the fair on the Fulton County Technology Fair website. I'm the only person that can do that. Between October the 16th and December the 1st, you should be working on your project and finalize your ideas. You should also look for any emails from the Tech Fair Committee from Fulton County. And then by December the 9th, 2023, you should be able to present your project at the designated time at Riverwood High School. Again, the Tech Fair registration, registration window is October the 16th through the 26th. And if you have any questions, you can always reach me by email. Thank you. Happy Hispanic Heritage Month. Congratulations to our three winners from yesterday's raffle. Blakely Elstead, Zara Stone Stonebrook, and Aylin Gwynn. Please come to the media center during third period to claim your prize. You are not only lucky, but you are correct. Demi Lovato is a Hispanic singer, songwriter, and actress who is also an ambassador for Free the Children, an organization revolving around anti-bullying, mental health, and gender equality. It's time for our next raffle question. Who is the first Hispanic woman inducted into the National Women's Hall of Fame? To enter the raffle, write the correct answer on a slip from your first period teacher and drop it in the media center by 4 p.m. today. Three winners will be announced during tomorrow's announcements. Buena suerte. Good luck. Today's spotlight is on Rob Roberto Clemente who is of Puerto Rican descent and is known mo and most known for his stellar baseball career with the Pittsburgh Pirates, but spent his time off-field involved in charity work. He was a human rights activist, organizing with charities to provide much-needed media attention and funding to Latin American countries. Clemente was killed in a tragic plane crash while delivering supplies to Nicaragua after an earthquake. He was determined to accompany the supplies himself after the first three flights were diver diverted by corrupted officials and never reached the victims of the earthquake. Haines Bridge students get ready to savor the flavor and indulge in the ultimate Fiesta Taco, National Taco Tuesday. It is just around the corner. In fact, it is tomorrow. Join us for a mouth-watering celebration of everyone's favorite handheld delight, the humble taco. Be sure to visit the cafe to watch all the Fiesta fun with tasty meals. If you are interested in trying out for volleyball. Please make sure you have a physical packet submitted. The second day of boys' trials are today. Girls will be tomorrow and Thursday. You will need to ride in the carpool lot by 520. And the Haynes Bridge Eagles soccer team takes on Sandy Springs tomorrow at 5.30 p.m. here at Haynes Bridge Soccer Pitch. Come out and support the Eagles soccer team tomorrow. Here's what's for lunch today. 
General Tso's chicken with fried rice, meat lover's pizza, fresh fruit, tater tots, and a side salad. Happy birthday to 6th grader Asian Mar- Mac Carvamoo Mar- and 7th grader Jack um, Jablonski. This is HBTV signing off. Have a terrific Tuesday and, and go, go Eagles! Eagles.